Hello, and welcome to Hypener for yet another thrilling briefing. This is our in-depth explanation of Aptera's battery structure. Range capacities 400 miles and 1,000 miles. And the reasons why Aptera, working with CTNS, its battery pack construction partner, is able to achieve mile-breaking ranges with its solar EV, even though most EV manufacturers still consider a 1,000-mile range car to be a pipe dream. Now let's move forward. One of Faria's top suppliers of battery packs is CT Enesco Limited. Since its founding in 2017, it has effectively completed high mixed low volume projects and grown to be a major force in the robotics industry as well as a dependable supplier of battery packs to well-known brands in Korea. Based on their proprietary smart manufacturing system and battery data management system, they offer high quality and dependable battery packs. A formal business relationship was established earlier this year between the companies through the signing of multiple agreements. The purpose of these agreements is to develop Aptera's battery pack program, collaborate on the development of other energy solutions and revenue streams, and prepare the ground for the establishment of a joint venture subsidiary tasked with advancing these initiatives. Offering services for the research, production, and management of battery packs for industries including robotics, electric vehicles, and air mobility, CTNS is a vertically integrated expert in battery innovation technology. As Aptera's Tier 1 battery maker and supplier, CTNS has extended its experience to the US to assist Aptera's efforts in developing, constructing, and verifying a dependable, high-quality, and energy-efficient battery pack program. The company will supply the Aptera battery pack for its solar electric vehicle, which is starting with a 400-mile range plus up to 41 miles per day, only from the sun's rays. It will also source and construct battery production lines for Aptera in Carlsbad K. CTNS has agreed to provide Aptera with $5 million in order to power the joint venture company and Aptera's battery pack program. The Korean grant program is also supporting this endeavor, and Aptera will get additional funding from the CEC, amounting to about $10 million for Aptera's battery manufacturing. Aptera needs to prepare all components as soon as possible if it hopes to begin vehicle deliveries by the end of this year. The battery pack is the subject of one of the company's most recent updates this year. Aptera completed the development of its battery pack with production intent and revealed a few intriguing details. However, before we go on, if you find what you're viewing enjoyable, please click the buttons for sharing, like and subscribing. This makes it possible for YouTube to be informed of your preferences. Additionally, you have the opportunity to be among the first people to view our videos as they are posted. Regards, now let's go on. The 41 kWh battery pack that powers the entry-level tricycle is a little bit larger than the 40 kWh one that we had anticipated. Six battery modules are included in the box, linked by Aptera's patent-pending bus bar design. With 416 cells presented by each of them, this Aptera option presents 2,496 cells. Given that each of these battery modules has a capacity of around 6.83 kilowatt hours, we can quickly compute the capacities of the 60 kilowatt hours and 100 kilowatt hours battery packs. With nine battery modules and 61.5 kilowatt hours, the former may be possible. The latter should have 15 so that 102.5 kilowatt hours would be its capacity. It's only true if you assume that every battery module will be the same size. Aptera might need to modify the modules to make them all fit inside the car if it chooses to use the largest battery pack option. With its liquid-cooled battery system and lack of radiators, the EV will use skin cooling technology thanks to grooves in its body as allow liquid to flow. In an Aptera release video, the company's engineers stated that they made every effort to remove any superfluous parts from the battery pack. It not only makes the Aptera lighter, but it also contributes to a higher energy density. The 41 kWh battery pack is anticipated to have a 400 mile, 644 km range with an energy content equal to 1.5 fuel gallons. Thus, it will receive 10 miles worth of energy. 16.1 kilometers worth. 
These figures will place the electric tricycle among the most energy efficient cars on the market when it goes on sale. Just the light year and the cold air. The high performance sapphire trim, which features three electric motors that collectively provide 1234 horsepower, was introduced by Liquid Air in 2024 to complement the Sapphire's incredibly powerful drivetrain. At the other end of the air spectrum, a brand new rear wheel drive pure model with an estimated 410 miles of driving range and an appealingly low starting price has surfaced. Atera keeps reviewing revolutionary successes with its SUV. However, what enables the battery packs in this car to have a range that is so much beyond miles? Together, let's respond to this. This boils down to the aerodynamic efficiency of Aptera, possibly among the most efficient vehicles available. With three wheels, an efficient drivetrain, and a remarkable tow drop shape, Aptera has created the most aerodynamic vehicle conceivable, pushing the boundaries of ultra-efficient transportation. In 2023, Pininfarina, known for its outstanding aerodynamic abilities and long history, collaborated closely with Aptera to verify the distinctive design of its state-of-the-art solar electric vehicles. Pininfarina has a remarkable history of designing and manufacturing recognizable automobiles and brands such as Maserati, Rolls-Royce and Ferrari. For its solar EVs to attain an industry-leading range of up to 1,000 miles per charge and the capacity to drive up to 40 miles per day straight from the sun's rays. Aptera credits its excellent energy efficiency to its carefully crafted aerodynamic shape. The Pininfarina Wind Tunnels engineer, Professor Morelli, provided research inspiration for Aptera's external design. Aptera continues this mindset by expanding on Professor Morelli's concepts and pushing the boundaries of aerodynamic efficiency. Aptera concluded correlation testing at the Pininfarina Wind Tunnel, which validated its computational fluid dynamics CFD, work, and provided information on the shape of the vehicle, which Aptera hopes will have the lowest coefficient of drag of any passenger vehicle in production. It's clear that aerodynamic efficiency is at the heart of our design just by glancing at Aptera. With a drag coefficient of 0.13, the Aptera is less aerodynamic than other production automobiles. It can travel a greater distance with less energy expenditure. The solar panels that come with the Aptera have a daily range of up to 40 kilometers. This implies that many Aptera owners won't have to use an electrical outlet to charge their vehicles. The undercarriage of Aptera swoops like the belly of a dolphin. By doing this, drag, the force of air flowing against the vehicle's motion, is decreased. Like a tiny swift airplane, Aptera is curled at the nose, broad along the sides, and tapering toward the trunk. Apart from its aerodynamic efficiency, Aptera's body is composed of carbon, making it over 50% lighter than most other cars on the road. This contributes to the car's lower energy use. The Never Charge car from Aptera is an incredible invention and a real showstopper or the start of a new age. The Aptera is a fantastic three-wheeler that rarely needs to be plugged in and can go over 1,000 miles on a single charge, all the while possessing a futuristic appearance and vibe. According to Chris Anthony and Steve Fambro, co-CEOs of Aptera, the reason behind our brand's obsession with efficiency is our desire to motivate individuals to do more than simply operate a motor vehicle. They were successful in creating a vehicle that appeals to those who share their ideas about what an EV ought to be. With almost 8,000 pre-orders placed thus far, the public is in favor of their cause. With this funding, the Aptera EV moves closer to production. With its sleek design and graceful movements, Aptera's never-charged vehicle evokes the spirit of an American eagle. Similar to muscles in animal's anatomy, the powertrain, and more especially the in-wheel motors, are positioned precisely where the power energy is required. Undoubtedly, never-charge is full of magic, and Elafi is happy to provide the necessary building blocks to support the brand's and the car's vision. Due to our reliance on the sun, our all-around sustainable power source, a minimal amount of charging may be necessary depending on your region. With solar power alone, one can travel up to 11,000 miles annually or 40 miles each day. An energy-absorbing composite material implanted in the vehicle's surface 
composed of steel and aluminum, is the mechanism underlying it. So, worrying about where to get a free charger would become obsolete. The lightweight and low-drag aerodynamics of Actoras never charge add to the vehicle's charm and increase its efficiency. The vehicle weighs 850 pounds in total and is made up of just four sizable sections. It is constructed out of lightweight composite materials. This is a significant improvement because standard electric cars contain 300 essential structural components, which increases the application's total cost and lengthier time to scale ratios. With stronger wheel fairings and a higher suspension, Nevercharge is giving some advanced features in an off-roading package to make the ride even more exciting and one of a kind. With Nevercharge, the possibilities and concepts are endless. I appreciate you being here. We sincerely hope you enjoyed the video. Please remember to share, like and subscribe. In the following video, I'll see you.